please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Mortis, that one refuses to get out of the news, seems to be the most suitable bride now. Fourth suitor on board, Nisha is with us. Nisha, just a day ahead of the board meeting, uh, there's one more person who's thrown their hat in the ring. Oh yes, and it's a Chinese player, Fosun, which uh, after the entire, remember, Glant Pharma saga that happened and they finally got in as an investor in Glant Pharma, now they are confident about Fortis as well. So they have put their hat in the ring. They have but given a non-binding offer. So this in comparison with Manipal TPG's binding offer and non-binding offers given by IHH as well as Munjal and Burman combination. So there are a whole host of suitors now lining up for Fortis Healthcare. Now, just to take you through what Fosun has really uh, proposed to give is 100 crore rupees to um, take care of the immediate liquidity requirement of Fortis Healthcare, where we think uh, that they do have certain liabilities to really manage by the end of this particular month. Apart from that, $350 million for less than 25% stake is what they have offered to give. Now, remember, there is a huge amount of similarity between the kind of offer that uh, Fosun has given and what Munjals and Burmans for the last one uh, have also given so we'll have to see which way the board really swings it's going to be a tough task for the board and then finally the shareholders will have to take that final decision